Hi boys and girls, wasn't it a great day? I love the songs and games and crafts. I learned so much about God's commandment and how much he loved his people. I just got back from my adventure at the Emerald Mountain Bridge. And I have something very interesting to tell Sydney. Will you help me call for him? Sydney! <sighs> oh, it's you, Jane. I'm glad you're back. Did you find the treasure? Did you find the purple gems at the bridge? Um, not exactly. I went with the children to listen to Bible stories and play games and do crafts. And when they were eating, I went off to the bridge to look for the purple gems. You did all that while I was eating? I sure did. <laughs> so, Jane, even with the map and the binoculars and the Bible, you didn't find the purple gems at the bridge. No, but I did find something purple. There are these 10 beautiful purple flowers. Do you know what they are? They are probably orchids. Orchids are special flowers that represent love. So when you see one, you can think of L-O-V-E. Love, really? That reminds me of our Bible story from today. You heard about orchids in the Bible story? No, silly, love. There was this man named Moses who went up on a mountain to talk to God. While he was there, God gave him these ten things for him and his people to show love to him and to others. Amazing! You know, Jane, I may be just a sloth, but I think you learned something you should treasure. You learned that God loved his people and wanted to teach them how to love too. Maybe you're right, Sydney. Maybe you're right. I'll come back tomorrow to find that special treasure. Will you children come back too? Great. Bye, Jane. Bye, children. See you tomorrow. It's time for my exercises. Huh. <sighs>